It's been very tough finding things in these last couple months, but here is a video showcasing some of the stuff that I was able to find in the local shops. So first off, I found these Lord of the Rings bookends. Uh, I think uh, these were from a DVD set. I found them at Goodwill for a decent price, $15. I figured they'd be good for some terrain. There was that one scene in the never-ending story with the two statues that smashed people, so that was kind of interesting. And then I found some turtles. These were actually a bit of a disappointment. I thought that this snapping turtle went on the base it was with, and it doesn't. I don't know what goes on this base. Uh, I might reuse that for something, because it's actually a kind of nice hard plastic base there. Uh, but the turtle ended up being a much softer plastic, uh, but the sea turtle actually looked a little bit nicer and had sharper details. Again, I have no idea where that base is from, but the sea turtle I'm definitely going to be using in an upcoming campaign. And then there was another somewhat disappointing item. This Game of Thrones end piece. I paid the princely sum of $10 for this, and man, it just doesn't look that good. <laughs> Maybe I'll repaint it later to make it look a little bit more like a statue. And finally, we got something from Godzilla. This is Biolante missing one of its tentacles. This was a toy from the, I believe, 1998 movie? Or maybe even 1988 movie, I think it was actually the original one. But yes, this is a plant monster that was bioengineered from roses and Godzilla. Very interesting. And even though this is not technically a thrift store deal, I thought I would showcase some of these miniatures that I got from a local record store slash comic book store. This is the great thing about having more D&D stuff in stock. More stuff goes on sale in local shops. I think these were a great deal at three bucks each. I, I don't know how many stores online are going to be selling them for that cheap. And I managed to purchase another cart, which is great because I definitely needed another one of those. So there you have it, all my finds from the last couple months. If you have found anything interesting in your local thrift shops or stores, please let me know in the comments below.